Jeremy Renner overwhelmed with goodness of snowplow incident interview. Jeremy Renner says he has been overwhelmed with such goodness, ahead of the airing of a TV interview about his serious snowplow accident earlier this year. The Marvel star, 52, said the immediate actions of multiple people were the reason he was still alive and that thank you will never be enough to express my gratitude. He has relived the incident, during which he was crushed by the six-ton machine. With US broadcaster Diane Sawyer in an interview that is due to air on Thursday. A previous trailer saw Renner reveal he was awake through every moment of the incident in which he broke more than 30 bones. In a light-hearted Instagram post ahead of the broadcast, he promised fans that he would share the 411 on the 911 situation and joked of offering free snowcat rides. For those that want the 411 on the 911 situation that happened this past New Year's morning. I spoke with the wonderful at Diana Sawyer to share details of the incident. Tune in if you like, he wrote. Thank you for all the positive, loving prayers for me and my family. I am so truly grateful and honestly overwhelmed with such goodness. It has taken the immediate actions of so many people that has kept me here alive. Thank you will never be enough to express my gratitude, so I can offer up some free snark at rides up at the house if you're interested. The interview will also feature a recording of the 911 call made in the aftermath of the incident in which Renner can be heard moaning in pain. The actor's nephew also recalls how he found his uncle at the scene. Since the incident Renner has kept his followers updated on his recovery, which has included using an anti-gravity treadmill and strengthening exercises. When asked in the interview if he would like to do Marvel stunts again, he says, I've lost a lot of flesh and burn in this experience. But I've been refueled and refilled with love and titanium. Jeremy Renner, The Diane Sawyer Interview, A Story of Terror, Survival and Triumph will air on the 6th of April on ABC.